So there are a handful of nutrients that are really important to support proper thyroid function. Without these things, your thyroid just doesn't work properly. So when your thyroid's out of balance, you can experience symptoms that you would never even think would be connected to your thyroid gland, but they are. Things like hair loss in both men and women, bad skin, cold hands and feet, low energy, low metabolism, stubborn body fat that you just can't seem to get rid of, and even bad sleep. So in this video series, we're gonna be exploring some of the essential nutrients that you need in order to have a healthy thyroid. Today, specifically, we're talking about selenium. Let's take a look at how a selenium deficiency can hurt your thyroid and what you can do to overcome your selenium deficiency to balance your thyroid once again. First off, what is selenium? Selenium is an essential mineral that's used in a lot of different ways in your body, including immunity boosting, supporting a healthy metabolism, and fighting against free radical induced inflammation. Eating foods with selenium or taking a regular selenium supplement have been shown to help with fertility, thyroid function, and even autoimmune disease. Selenium is needed for healthy thyroid function because it works with other minerals like iodine, zinc, and copper, which I'm also gonna be talking about in this video series, to properly produce thyroid hormone balancing the thyroid and helping overcome and prevent either hypothyroidism or hyperthyroidism. So it's really important to have all these different minerals in the right forms and dosages in your body for a healthy thyroid since they all interact with one another and they help balance each other out. So if you're deficient in selenium or any of the other minerals, thyroid imbalance just happens. It's that simple. It's no wonder hypothyroidism and hyperthyroidism are so common in the general population right now because it's so easy to be deficient in these things if you don't supplement or eat the right foods regularly. So which thermo foods are high in selenium that you should be eating regularly? First up on the list is eggs. Get some good organic pastured eggs. One large egg has 22% of the daily value. When it comes to foods high in selenium and iodine as well, eggs definitely make the list. If possible, get the organic eggs produced by free range hens. Uh, next up we have sardines, where just one ounce of sardines has 21% of the daily value. These are a great source of selenium. Another great one is grass-fed beef, where just three ounces has 18% of your daily value. It's a food that's just super rich in selenium and in zinc as well as a lot of different other nutrients. Now next up on the list we have beef liver, where just one ounce has 14% of the daily value of selenium. You also can cook mushrooms, where one cup of cooked mushrooms has 27%. And these make for a great uh, vegan and vegetarian approved source of selenium and a lot of different other essential nutrients. And if you want selenium from a supplement form, I highly recommend finding selenium in the form of selenium glycinate because it's highly bioavailable and easy for your body to absorb and use. And that's why I included selenium glycinate in my new Umzu supplement, Thyrite and the exact dosage shown in the research to make the biggest impact in helping you have a healthy thyroid. If you wanna try a bottle of thyroid for yourself and you want a 10% off coupon, just go to umzu.com slash thyroid right now. I also recommend eating by the thermo diet principles to heal your thyroid because it's gonna give you a lot of energy, a higher metabolism, and it's gonna to help to overcome that imbalance by getting you the right nutrients that you need, like selenium, in your regular eating habits. So you can check out more about Thermo over at thermodiet.com. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more like it, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video.